Uh, okay, hi guys. Um, today I will give a webinar of our uh, product on 3D Viewer. So um, to have a brief talk on the 3D Viewer and uh, here just want to let you guys know what is a 3D Viewer. So 3D Viewer is, um, is a model uh, like this one, it's a 3D model with 720 degree display and they can change texture and put on the webs and add to card and connect it with the other system. Uh, and uh, here uh, is an example of our uh, client's website. And as you guys can see here is a 3D view model and uh, it's able to enlarge uh, into the detail and uh, allowed to have a 720 degree display. And also it can, has different uh, dimension angles to be changed. And also has the uh, dimensional display on the exact uh, uh, inches of the product. Also, this one can have um, AR display. If you guys have your uh, phone camera to scan the QR code and you can see the model in the AR uh, scenario. So actually what do you have to see this one is a 3D viewer. So 3D viewer actually um, it is uh, um, this product uh, is open to the enterprise account um, for now. So if you guys have any uh, demand for this product, you can um, ask CSC colleague uh, or our sales pals to upgrade your account to the enterprise account. And uh, so I'm going to give a short operation um, today. So about the 3D viewer um, added. So 3D viewer added, as you guys can see, um, in the 3D viewer added, we have uh, three main features. So the first one is it allowed to uh, adjust the line. So it can set the environment line and change the background settings. And the second one is for material replacement. So in 3D viewer added, um, you can change a different component in different texture. So uh, as you guys can see, after you set all of this, um, and you can have a you can have a material change in your 3D uh, model display, like this one. Also, uh, 3D viewer can change the reflection effect on the material. You can change your um, fur uh, into another reflection um, effect if you want and uh, any other of the texture. And the third the feature, uh, the third feature of 3D viewer is lens setting. So as you know, we have 720 degree uh, of the 3D viewer. Also you could set, I only allow it to show the 360 degree. And then after you set finish setting, the model will be just uh, able to um, see different angle like this. So uh, your clients can always see all of the uh, bottom of this model. Okay, so actually here are the three main features uh, in the 3D viewer edit. Also another one we would like to um, mention is in material replace. Uh, we also allow to drag and drop uh, the materials uh, quickly uh, in the same model. And uh, uh, for example, if you have a well, hundred texture in your system, and then but the model um, it only has three textures, and then you can add different texture on this same model um, on the same time uh, in the three D viewer edit. And also you can change the effect of this texture. For example, I can change the uh, blue one into uh, um, reflection, uh, reflect, reflection effect of this 
uh, texture, and then all of your models, um, which select the blue uh, texture, will have the same effect. And here we have, um, yeah, here we we have a short, um, here we have a short preview. Okay, so in the three D viewer, um, edit as you guys can see. Here we change the brightness, we change the angle of the light, and we change the studio. And we change the background. Also, background here can be a blue color and also can be an image which you upload to the system. And then the second one is the material editing to have different um, brightness, different flexion, gloss uh, effect. And it allowed to change material in different components for in more details. So this can uh, be more flexible for you guys to um, give your clients a realistic uh, 3D model uh, view. And then it's to change the angles, set the max and the minimum application uh, to the 3D model, as you guys can see. And uh, besides this, we also have what we we also have what we showed you guys earlier about the material editing. So after you select the model. Um, and add any one you want, then the texture can be um, added directly. And it also can be delayed. You can drag and move to change the texture. Change the texture order, and uh, you could also delay the texture you don't, you, you don't need. and rename a texture. Okay, so after you save the 3D viewer edit, you can see the final one. To change the model in different texture as soon as you can. Okay, so, so this one actually show you guys uh, how could we uh, get a 3D viewer model like this one, like this. Uh, and then we also do have 3D viewer set. Uh, 3D viewer set different way the 3D viewer is a 3D viewer focused on the single model, as you guys can see here, is a single one. Um, yeah, perfectly see is this one. Yeah, so it's a single model. But actually for 3D viewer set is you, combine different 3D viewer model together into a 3D viewer set, like this one. Okay, so the sofa here is a 3D viewer set. So we upload different um, components as a single uh, model and combine them together. Therefore, client can change the component um, by themselves and uh, which have a more DIY uh, customized experience. Therefore, we have a client who uses 3D viewer and shows 3D viewer set effect here. As you guys can see, this one is a 3D viewer model. And uh, when they combine the model together, um, they, can, they can show a 3D viewer set at, at this one. So how, how we provide a very uh, easy and a quick way for our client to come by and finish setting of this one. So in the so in the third viewer set, and we enter into the editor page. We could import the model we would like to come by. And uh, we also could choose the replace item we would like to set. You could duplicate the replace item and put them in the relevant angles. 
after you finish setting, actually, after you finish all of the setting, you can see uh, I import not only one of the replace item here. So for one table, I import four replace item in total. Therefore, once I uh, finish setting of the angle of the position of the replace item, then um, any other of the replace item, they will be replaced on the right position. So I don't need to change um, every set, every group of the replace models. Okay, so as, a, as you guys can see, I only set the default one, the default replace one. And uh, as I change another um, replace item group, and they were in the right place. So one click makes the replace finish. And the final effect is like this. So the table could, with, uh, could combine with different set of chairs. Okay, so here's the, here is the, what we've uh, told about the 3D viewer uh, on our website, what does it look like and uh, how to finish the setting in the 3D viewer uh, enterprise system. Um, so, okay. Okay, so if, if you guys do have any uh, interest on the 3D viewer, you could tell me and then I could I could share more. Thank you, Amber. So uh, do you have any questions for Amber? Uh, in the meantime, I just send a feedback on uh, the chat box. Uh, so if you have time, please fill the form to let us know the opinion about the lecture. And do you like it or do you have any suggestion for us? Um, thank you for the support. And 